Howdy, what is marketing automation? Let's find out today on Good Morning Marketing. Good morning, welcome to Good Morning Marketers. My name is Bruce Williams, Senior Director of Development Department at ThunderTech. And I'm Kyle Coughlin, Marketing Automation Specialist. And today we're talking marketing automation. Uh, so Kyle, I'll start. Mm -hmm. uh, the perception I think out there today by most marketers uh, watching the show here uh, is that maybe maybe not the you know the the absolute perception mm -hmm. of some, but I think the vast majority think uh, the the ideal, the holy grail, is that Amazon esque mm -hmm. experience of marketing automation, where mm -hmm. uh, these platforms know what our customers are going to do before right. they even know it themselves. Right. Mm -hmm. So, what is the reality? So, in reality, automation platforms are business intelligence platforms. We want to be using these systems to help learn about our audience. You know, it's no more these gut feelings. I think they're doing this, but in actuality, they're doing that. So using these systems to see what content they're engaging with on the website, really understanding what their needs are to get them from that awareness stage all the way down to consideration then purchasing. Okay. So that, I, I mean, that sounds really nice. Mm -hmm. uh, who within the organization right should be involved yeah. for the best results. Key stakeholders from marketing, sales, customer service, you know, that, that C-suite certainly needs to be involved because this is a holistic approach to a new revenue source where we are learning about folks. We're not just going with our gut feelings. And from that perspective, we want to be having folks who have those day-to-day -day interactions with the audience so that we're not just Again, going off of gut feeling, but we have real interactions with those folks that we can pull into the content that we're creating. Okay. So uh, traditionally, I think a, a lot of us, you know, even with Amazon out mm -hmm. there and all those big box stores mm -hmm. out there and the, the e-commerce yeah. uh, related transactions and content that's, that's pushed, uh, a lot of us relate to automation, I think, uh, around the B2B and professional services yeah. space. Is it just right for B2B professional services. And it's definitely a misconception that we hear quite often where uh, I'm not B2B, can automation still work for me? And the answer is yes, it certainly can. Uh, it's, again, all about learning about your audience. So both B2B and B2C organizations have customers and we need to learn more about them and their needs. So certainly if you're a B2C organization, automation can help you. It's gonna be on a much larger scale because you're audience is certainly going to be larger. There's going to be more individuals out there, but yes, it can certainly work for you. Okay. And why should I get, if I'm a marketer out there, mm -hmm. uh, why should I get an agency involved? What, uh, you know, when I want to get started with marketing automation, what kind of value does an agency bring for me? And that's certainly the uh, experience of on those different platforms. We are in these automation systems on a daily basis from, you know, HubSpot to, Ant to Marketo to uh, Pardot. It's certainly a wide range. So okay. we see the ins and outs of those systems. We know the uh, little nuances of them so we can help guide you in the direction of which system could be right for you. It's not a silver bullet. One system does not fit all. So we definitely take a deep dive into understanding what your needs are, what your audience needs are, the features and functionality that could really help and come to an unbiased solution for you. Okay, great. Yeah. All right. So whether you're a seasoned veteran at marketing automation or you're just beginning, please, if you want to learn more, please uh, reach out to thundertech.com.